Hey guys, Wolfmaster here. I'm playing Burnout Paradise like I says I would. I said I would, oops. <laughs> and uh, it's currently like 5.30 in the morning, so if I sound sleepy, that's probably why. But uh, yeah, today we're going to be playing some Burnout Paradise. I'm going to do a couple of road rages and then maybe some races or something. And uh, I would do a full playthrough, but I've gotten a little bit through and feel like creating a new save, so... But that, that's fine. So, uh, right here I'm about to be uh, starting up the game. And, uh... Hopefully you guys like this series, because I'm going to probably do a bunch of these Burnout Paradise things. But also, like, Minecraft, Saints Row, more Sleeping Dogs. Plenty of games, like I mentioned in my other video. So, uh, right here I'm just selecting my car, and it takes a little while to load. So I'm getting the, uh, the Krieger Pioneer Super Gator, which is like an upgraded version of the other one. It's a big SUV, but here's the other two cars I got that I'll probably use soon. They're uh, kind of nice, especially the uh, the one that looks like the uh, GTR Skyline, that's it. Uh, I like that one. But uh, I'm going to use this one because we're doing road rages and you need a big heavy car. And uh, this is probably the one to do that in. Nah, uh, I'm going to change it from lime green because it doesn't look great in green with the alligator. I made it sort of a red in green which actually looks kind of cool. But uh, basically what we're going to be doing is a couple of road rages and stuff. Just a reminder that there are uh, this could be a fairly long video compared to what I normally do. It's going to be about 14 minutes long or so. I mean, if you like longer videos, then I can do longer ones, but tell me if you do or not. So I'm just looking for the races to do. There is a road rage right down the road for me, which is pretty good. So we're going to go do that one. Here's my horrible attempt at trying to do a reverse 180 in this thing. Just smash the back end on these walls. That's no big deal. We're gonna be smashing this car up anyway. And uh, once we get to the race, or the road rage, I'm decently good at road rages and stuff because I have played Burnout before. Played Paradise and also like Burnout 2 and 3 on the PS2. Uh, those are pretty fun, especially Burnout 3. And beat the target without totaling your car or running out of time. Okay, so uh, here we go. Here I start immediately crash into an SUV by accident, so just ignore that. Uh, these are fairly simple. The takedown target's four, but I'm probably gonna get a lot more than that. Here I was trying to get these people who are in the same car as me because those are the harder to take down ones. Here we're going around <laughs> trying to drift, didn't want to, but that's fine. And uh, take that guy down in the Yakuza GT. I believe that's what that was. Some of these vehicles I'll probably unlock soon, like that one that just passed me. That's a quite a nice one, it's based off a Dodge Magnum. It's called the Hot Spur, I think? Something like that. The Spur, that's what it was. And uh, there, I took him down. Yeah, but there's a couple of vehicles in this game that I really like. You'll probably be seeing them later on. I'm gonna try to do like a full playthrough of this from where I am now. Maybe, if you guys want me to. Uh, there, just took down that pickup truck to reliables, reliable custom, something like that. It's a pretty nice little truck. It's an old school one. Here, I crash right into that wall because I wasn't paying attention. And, uh, so far, I'm doing pretty well. I'm at seven takedowns. I only needed four. I've still got a minute and 23 seconds. Here's where I really messed up. I took that guy out, but then I crashed right into that wall in the train track. Which just completely messed me up. Here we're gonna take this guy down when he tries to pass me. I'm very paranoid in games like this, that's why I always look behind me. Because those guys can ram into you and it's not good. That guy right there, take him out. He just glitched out too. We're coming around there, going to hit that guy. Doing a lot of damage to him as well. Especially the, uh, the ones like my truck. Uh, 
Ah, I'm sorry about that uh, cut right there. That's switching to the next clip of the video. And, uh, this is where I left off taking out people in this road rage here in my Pioneer Super Gator. <coughs> I also like some of the names of these cars, they're pretty cool. Well, this guy right here is in a lime green Dodge Magnum car. Now, once I eventually get like a camera and a microphone, I'm gonna do some old school games for like PS2 and the original Xbox. But until then, you'll probably see Xbox One games and like backwards compatible 360 games. Because I would hook up the capture card, but it doesn't pick up my audio and uh. I don't know if I could do that or not. But here I uh, won the uh, Road Rage with 15 takedowns, which isn't too bad. And, uh, brings me up to a Class C with 13 wins to upgrade, which is uh, it's going to take a little while. Here I'm just cruising around. I'm going to find another Road Rage to do. If you see right there, it's right there. It's quite a bit away, but we're going to get there. <coughs> This thing may be a big heavy SUV, but it's actually really fast. Well, I mean, for one of the starting sort of vehicles. Yeah, the only reason I didn't play like my other save is because it's like it's completed. It's boring when it's completed, so I just start a new game and played from there. So you got more stuff to do. Now the next video I'm gonna do, I'm probably gonna do some races, and that's gonna be. After a while, possibly in the afternoon, so as I said before, it was like 5.30 in the morning, so this will be maybe like 5 at night or so. And, uh, probably do another game too today if you, uh, if you would like that. Not too many of you guys actually comment on the videos, but hey, if you, uh, want to suggest something, make sure to let me know. And uh, hopefully we can get some more subscribers soon, because I've been at 17 for quite a while. I mean, I'm probably not that good at YouTube, but I'm trying. It's road rage. Beat and the uh, here we go, starting this takedown uh, road rage thing here. This one, the goal is 5. I think the last one was like 4. Oh, something I found cool. Oh, I just got taken down. Is that the enemies have like their headlights are red, which looks kind of cool. Fortunately, it's only like I think that's a theory arrival or something. If they take you, I, I do know. It used to be like that in the old days, but I don't know if it's still like that or not. Yeah, I'm just crashing all over that place. I got that guy to crash into a wall. I accidentally get up in this tunnel here. Didn't mean to go in here, but it's fine until I hit the wall. Luckily, I didn't wreck there. Because, uh, that wouldn't be good. But, uh, we're going down this road here about to try to hit these guys. They're pretty fast, but I think I can catch up to them. Just taking out this guy real quick, if I can. He's pretty tough. For some reason, in this race, the people don't want to get taken down as easily. Like, that guy just crashed into the wall on his own. But I did take that guy down right there. I think you just see him up here driving like crazy. You go over that jump by accident, but it would work. Too bad I didn't have a stunt class car, otherwise it would have got more boost. Uh, we're gonna take this guy down right here. Oh, he took me down. I uh, guess I spun out or something. That was weird. There is a really weird thing that's gonna happen later on, where I'm gonna accidentally get vertically taken down by like a glitch or something. I try to take down somebody while they're going off a jump, and then they land on me. He didn't even hardly hit me. It just, it still got taken down because he touched the roof of my car. But yeah, I'm going to take that guy down. And I believe it's coming up shortly. And there, I just crashed right into the median. So I tried to swerve back to my lane, but didn't have enough time to do so. But we're almost at the goal, and uh, there we go, we have hit the goal of five takedowns. Oh wait, when you get way up in the game, you get more- Oh, there it goes. There's the glitchy takedown, where he barely touches me, but it still takes me down. And uh, I think my damage was critical. 
which is not good, but I do still get more takedowns without crashing. The only bad thing about having critical damage is if you get taken down or crash, you're, it's done. That's the uh, it ends, but here we go, taking this guy down. You don't get to see me go off the jump because I took this guy down, so it just teleports me on the other side of it, which kind of sucks. This guy just gets completely smashed into a pillar. That, that looked very painful. Here could have been a bad thing if I would have hit one of those, but I did manage to dodge it and hit that guy into one. It completely destroyed him. And there made this guy crash into a wall, so now I'm just going on a roll. I get There's only seven seconds left. I don't know if I get it. Yeah, I do get one more takedown. I believe this is it. I try to hit the rest of these guys, but the time runs out. And then I get taken down at the end, which just destroys my car. And uh, there you go. That was another road rage completed. Need to do 12 more runs. As I said before, I'm going to be uh, doing races, so I believe now I'm going to switch my car to the Akuza GT or the uh, Skyline. And then uh, after a while, I'm going to do some more races with that. And uh, possibly some of the other activities. And. Uh, also trying to unlock more cars because that's one of the main things. Uh, some of the other you know, the cars that are coming up next are pretty nice, so I'm looking forward to those. And uh, I also might play Minecraft later, I don't know, I'll have to see. But uh, I was thinking about playing, um, let's see, what was it? I can't remember, but I'll probably just like, figure it out later. Might do that tomorrow. Try to do like some of these YouTubers do an upload once every day, but that's gonna be kind of tricky. I don't know if I can do that or not. We'll just have to wait and see. But here I smashed into that car thinking it wouldn't hurt me, and it just completely obliterated me. But that's okay. Now here I'm approaching the uh, junkyard to go get the new car. You're not going to see me do any races in it, but you will like uh, see me drive it a little bit. It handles a lot differently than this thing. It's a lot more slippery. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty hard to control if you don't know what you're doing. Now, the last time I played this game was a while back, so... I'm not great at doing things on here, but I will get better. I would, I did a cool game that I wish I could play or like record video of, but like Need for Speed Underground or Underground 2, like uh, the old school games. I'll have to try to buy some more PS2 games and then you know like a camera or something, try to record them. You don't see too many uh, people doing that. But uh, this will be over pretty soon, you know, just like fix the car, because it's ugly when it's all damaged, but probably gonna end up crashing it anyway. And just refill my boost, why not? It's not really any point to doing that, but you can see it's a massive drift. Accidentally go into Big Surf Island. Don't have the DLC on there because it's on the 360. And uh I'm not buying it again on the Xbox One. But uh if you wanna see me do that then you'll like have to wait a while. I don't know, because like, my other like account thing that I have has like modded cars on it, and I don't feel like using those. But uh, instead we'll just do this, like a new sort of playthrough type thing. And uh, that'll probably about wrap it up. If you want to see more Burnout or other games, just let me know and I'll try my best to do them. And also uh, eventually get camera for old school games because my birthday is coming up in July so maybe I'll be able to get one and uh, goodbye.